Are we good? We're good? All right. We're good. Hey, guys. It's Lee Guitar Thursday, and it's John. I'm here from the shop. I uh, got a bunch of surprises for you today. We didn't get a ton of new stuff in. Um, I don't know if you guys know about it. There is this uh, virus thing going on. Um, people are talking about it, but we're not because I don't know why we're not. But we got cool stuff in. Um, ignorance is bliss. Ignorance is bliss. And Brian is correct with that because he is as ignorant as anybody I've ever met, yes, yet extremely blissful. <laughs> anyway, uh, got a new shipment in from Calton Cases, including this new gunmetal gray uh, glitter case. Look at that. Shiny, shiny. Of the black interior. Another dreadnought. This one's a great one. Um, so it's not quite as flashy as some of the ones we've had. Um, I still have this pearl one, which I loved. I still think about taking it. Black interior, gunmetal gray. Uh, really nice. Again, we like the uh, glitter cases because they add extra thermal uh, protection to these cases so you have reflections. Kind of think of it like a space blanket for yourself or I guess anything else. Um, big pocket space, great case. Just came in. These are super durable. This is by far the most durable cases that we carry and we carry a lot of good flight cases but man these new Caltons are so well done. Um, so that one's the new gunmetal gray and a dreadnought. Also, finally got in, we sold the last deluxe mandolin. So I got another one in. This one is in fool's gold. And it's smooth finish. So this is that smooth uh, finish. I've got the new molds for those. Smooth, shiny, gorgeous mandolin case. These are the deluxe ones, like I said before. This was something that me and Jeremy had a hand in designing and helping out with something with more space than your standard Kelton case. Um, I like this color a lot. Again, black interior. Look at that huge pocket space, very deep. So you can get a lot of stuff in there. Plus you still have this standard pocket space and something that a lot of people were worried about with the original ones. There's more space for the little point on here before it runs in the space. So more padding there and a lot more space for those bigger peg heads. There's some of uh, the mandolins like I think uh, Sorensen builds and some of those that have a slightly bigger peg head. Uh, look at that, he's got a, look, you can fit a full base bridge in there. Um, but uh, really nice case, smooth mold on this. So it'll be the shiny mold in a deluxe. So I have that in. A um, few, uh, few other instruments that have come in. Uh, not a lot. I've got a big shipment on its way. Uh, very shortly. Uh, in fact, I just told it shipped yesterday from Eastman. But as you see, we've been selling a lot of stuff. You don't have to worry about it. We won't get you in the spring. <laughs> Good. Uh, Guild came in. We do have Cordova uh, nylon strings in. Quite a bit of really nice ones just came in not too long ago. The PCH line and the uh, ones and two lines, uh, they're kind of getting slim. There's not a whole lot in uh, California right now. And as you know, there's not lot coming into the country so it'll be a while to see a lot of those oh, cures are in stock I am down to one E20 but I do believe I've got more of those coming in both the e, uh, E10 and E20s in the OM are available so we can sell that E6 thermal cure that's on its way I hope she enjoys that um, great great guitar um, I just sold one of the Breedlove guitars oh this one we talked about this last week the travel guitar, Oven Call, great guitar. Um, I do have a new McPherson Carbon coming in very shortly. Um, that'll be coming in. I have a couple of the shearing guitars. Uh, one of the Breed Loves, I sold its mate today. So that's a good one. Um, and again, the Octave Mandolins, I've got a couple of those. And once those are gone, they're gone. I've got an MDA 315. Uh, there are no more MD 305s. So those eight valves are all gone. Um, the banjos, we've got a few things on their way, so hopefully we'll be seeing more and more of those. Um, as far as new product on New Guitar Thursday, not a ton. Uh, I'm going to have Brian's going to join me soon as soon as he gets things ready to roll. Are you ready? Cool. I'll talk about a guitar that I absolutely love, and Brian will talk about a guitar that he absolutely loves. I'm going to grab this guitar and then I'll switch off of this microphone. Hi Trent, how you doing Trent, how you doing? I got Brian today guys, this is, this is, okay you can mute it there, that's good for me. We got a big shout out to our production crew, 
Trent. Trent is Parentis. He's our entire crew in one. He's, uh, <laughs> hi, <laughs> good job. That was, you framed yourself well on that. So, what do you got, Brian? This is Brian, by the way. If you don't know this already. Me? Brian is here. That's your, that's your whole audience. Say hi to, hi to the folks. Hello, I am Brian. <laughs> Brian is the uh, uh, star of the Monday morning show. You may have heard of it. It's reached all the channels of the world. Really? Yep. I I, my next guest will be Oprah. Oprah? Really? Yes. How I, did you work that out? Uh, magic. Harpo, I believe, is actually who you got into. It's, Harpo. It's, it's, it's Oprah uh, backwards, in case you didn't know that. Oh, Harpo. I was thinking of Harpo Marx. Well, that too. Right? Um, no, my show is amazing, and everyone <laughs> loves it. It's probably the most popular show on the Acoustic Shop page right now. It's hilarious, and I am humble. I love that you told everybody how great you are. That's uh, really good. Oh, we now uh, have moved off frame. Uh, oh. <laughs> but that's all right. Oh, we're, you're the we're clearing, Yeah, just, just oh. a little bit. We're, we're, look at that. Trent, the pan, back at it again. The, the, the panning head on the uh, tripod moved just a hair. Oh. <laughs> by tripod, or by uh, tripod, I meant the... Uh, the, uh, the chair. <laughs> the rocket sock stool. Yes, which we do have right here, by the way. If you have not already checked, we've got a few of these left. I need to put in a new order for these. These are the ultimate S practice seats stools. right here. We love these. It's um, very, very comfortable. It is. And it has a little foot peg, although mine's on the back side, so I don't get to use it. Mine but, is not. Uh, yours is in the right spot. Good for you. So anyway, what are you playing today, Brian? Well, this guitar here is actually the exact same guitar that I bought here uh, not do. too long ago. This you is an Eastman E2OM. It's a cedar top. Um, I just really fell in love with these. I don't know what it is about cedar, but the warm tone, I really, really love it. It's got some paley back inside. It's all solid. It's super lightweight, which I, I really like because I was playing a big old hulky right now for a while, and it kind of felt cumbersome. Yeah, some of us can handle this. that, and some of us can't. Some of us are, are boys, and some <laughs> of us are men. Uh, but now I can play, you know, like finger style kind of stuff too. I've gotten into that, and you know, it's just it's broadened my horizon. They're great, and a, a great affordable guitar. Yes, Still have the sure. lifetime warranty. Um, great, great guitar. Mm -hmm. I went to the other end of the spectrum. I went to a really a man's high guitar. End. Yeah, I went to a dread. No, <laughs> this guitar actually, I rediscovered this guitar. We have a heck of a buy on this guitar. It's been in here a little longer than I want it to be. So if you're interested, make sure to call us because there's a great buy on this guitar right now. Um, it's a Hudson Dalton Custom TDR. So that's traditional dreadnought rosewood. Um, but here's what's cool about it. It is a Madagascar so rosewood pretty. set. It is beautiful. It's yeah. very Brazilian rosewood-like. Yeah. And it has a very Brazilian rosewood tone to it. I rediscovered this because I started playing it yesterday, and I love it. Thermocured Sitka top. I know everybody's into the Adirondack tops and Thermocure. Um, I am really proud of how this one turned out. This guitar sounds great together. So Sitka top. Um, the sunburst is gorgeous on this. It's kind of awesome to be able to see a sunburst that starts the natural color of that Thermocured top and works its way out to this kind of reddish dark color. Uh, this, the traditional uh, D45 style snowflakes uh, that's the older vintage uh, d45 styles um just a great guitar i'll tell you what you want to know what my favorite thing on here Trent is take a look at this i found this today the oval buttons everybody's been doing waverly tuners with butter beans these are the ovals this is the way the early yeah. uh, mid to late 30s uh guitars were done they had an oval button that was a, a grover tuner but these are the waverly ones and I just found that today, and I'm like, I dig that. <laughs> I'm going to probably have to put those on one of my guitars. Yeah, just that's awesome. But Brian said he'd sing a song for us today, oh, and I'm going to mess it up for him because I've never played it before. Except yeah. for we just went over it. We went over it once. It was good. His was solo right. was nice. Let's hope he doesn't mess up. I will probably uh, mess it up. But who cares? Because, you know, one thing about these videos is it's just, you know, it's like reality TV, you know? <laughs> It's like it catches so us in our TV. in our raw moments, you know. <laughs> None of this is fake at all. This is how I really am, and this is how John really is. Oh, I got no choice but to be this. <laughs> exactly. <way. laughs> so uh, please take this uh, this raw, uncut song that I wrote a few months ago that I have yet to release, and will release maybe later. This is probably just this is it's going to be a release. You know, you really you, you're not going to be able to do it better than this now. Yeah, I know. I'm thinking. I was like, man, that was a cool solo. Maybe I should ask him to. <laughs> You're such a liar. So, I appreciate that. Somebody's no. after a race. <laughs> I see what just happened right there. <laughs> All right, whatever. <laughs> okay, here we go. Uh, this is called Lightning Bolt. What a 
I almost sort of got on with it, and it was great. It's okay. I liked it. I like the solo. I really do. Yeah, I wasn't. Even, it wasn't even just brownie points. Thank you. Thank you, Brian. It was fun. <laughs> it was great. I, anyway, that was another New Guitar Thursday. Thanks, Brian. Thanks, Trent. Thanks, everybody. Yes, we are still rolling. Yes, there's lots of cool stuff coming into the shop. Keep coming out. Come visit us. Uh, if you haven't checked out the website yet, check out theacousticshop.com, where we have always free shipping and one of the best guarantees in the business. So uh, mm -hmm. check that out. Check out all these instruments, and uh, thanks for being with us. It's New Guitar Thursday, and we're out of here.